People have been requesting me to do more example solves in each video, so here are two ZB example solves today. Scramble white top and green front to follow along. Here's the first scramble. Cross pieces are here, 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 and here. On this scramble, there's a block right here, and this edge gets solved after inserting the blue. So I decided I'm gonna hold it from right here and insert blue like that and then solve this corner later on by doing b prime r it solves these two cross edges and the edge in the back and then i can insert that corner into the back i insert this corner like this right here forming the square but then before aligning the huge block you have a pair right here and a pair right here i was tracking this pair earlier so first i would actually do u to preserve this pair right here and then do F like this to align this cross edge. Then I'll do a D, a U2 to solve this pair right here, and then solve this cross edge on top of that cross edge. Next, you can solve this pair right here, but you have a three mover instead, and then you can just use this pair as your last pair. So I'm going to just do that. I'll rotate to solve this into the back, and then you have this for ZBLS. This is very, very easy. You just have the pair and the misoriented edge right here. You can just take it out and insert with F moves or take it out, rotate and insert. From here, you can do U2 to recognize the ZBLL. You can notice these two are adjacent and these two match and these two match and there's just this huge block right here. So this is a super easy recognition. This is also a super easy ALG too. It goes like this. With the U prime AUF. Faster it looks like this. Now on to solve two. On this scramble, cross pieces are here, 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 and here. And I'm gonna do a cross solution to make this pair right here a free pair. I'm also gonna use this corner and this edge as my second pair. So to start off my cross, I'm gonna do a U and then L prime to insert this cross edge right here alongside that one, making the free pair right here. It also puts this corner into the bottom. Keep that in mind for later. Then do a D2, put blue in red's place right now, and then move blue over and put red down. You still have this free pair in the top, so now you can go straight into it. But before going into it, you could see from inspection this edge ended up right here and this corner ended up right here. So you can insert the three mover, then move it over and then you can go directly into this pair right here. Next, you have this free pair right here, super lucky, and you can just do a hedge right here to orient some edges. And that sets us really nicely up into ZBLS. For this ZBLS, you just have this for your pair and you have a hook right here that's touching this white corner. For this case, you started off by doing a commutator and you cancel into sledgehammer. Then that gives you a soon ZB. For this soon ZB, you can notice these two are opposites and these two are matching right here. So this is like a Nick Loss case. For the edges, you can notice there's a block right here and this one matches this block and these two are opposites. For this alg, you do a U and then the algorithm goes like this. Faster looks like this. Let me know what you think about doing multiple solves in a video and let me know what you think about adding background music to the videos. I'm testing it out and I'm seeing if you guys like it in the videos. Also make sure to shop at thecubicle.com with discount code Kaden. Hope you learned something. Peace out.